What is up, guys? This is Game Storms here. Sorry, my voice is really bad right now. I'm trying to get it back for tomorrow, but I need to make this quick video because there's going to be a title update coming out for Gears UE on February 23rd. And I just wanted to read off what's going in the update because I'm excited what is being done with the update. This is probably one of the better updates. So to start off, all social playlists kills will now count towards seriously achievement. Which is great because I should have that shit already, but I don't. Because I only play social. Because TDM is only in social. Next on the list is improvements to the hit detection for the boom shot. Which is fantastic. I know everybody has these problems where you shoot the boom shot doesn't explode or it just doesn't down them or anything and you dip or let's say you're up close to somebody you'll shoot it you'll get down they won't get down it's it's a whole mess so they fix that there or they did their best to fix it um they fix some wait times for matchmaking when like i experienced this when like let's say i would leave a lobby after i finished the match then it would take like forever to find another match. I would have to usually quit the game and restart to get my match back, but that's good. They have improved hit registration on downed enemies, which is great. So there won't be near as much sponging on them. Um, improve it to the left trigger issue. I don't know what that is. The left trigger issue, I'd, I haven't experienced that problem yet. There's an and fixed hit detection on shooting an enemy cover against the top pillars on clock tower remove the POI on right stick for alternate control scheme and bug fixes in general improvements god this is hard to talk Ugh. they've also increased the amount of XP you get in execution by a lot since so it's one of the harder game modes to play they move blitz into social. I don't know if they kept it in competitive. It just says move blitz from competitive to social. So I don't know if they just kept it in competitive and then put it in social if it's only in social now. But here's the big news. They finally brought TDM back into competitive. Which I am really excited for. Um, I'll be doing that. I'll be playing competitive a bit more. Not by myself. But when I have friends will be playing competitive TDM. They've also brought back Warzone for a permanent playlist. And they brought Assassination back for a little while to see how well it turned out, how many people want to play it. So, with the update, they are bringing a special event coming on it's coming tomorrow it's coming on the 23rd and it's going to through the whole weekend it's called seriously tedia now i'll try and bring you guys a gameplay of this if my voice is back it is going to be a, in social and competitive and it's going to be tdm it's going to have 30 respawns around and it's First to two rounds like it usually is. So there's going to be a lot of kills. And the whole point they're doing this. Is to help you rack up your kills. Towards your. So, um, your seriously. Achievement. For social categories. So that is going to be awesome. It's going to be long ass matches of TDM. Very long matches. And a lot of kills. Well I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Please leave in the comments down below if you liked any of the updates that are coming. And please wish me luck on getting my voice back. Because this is horrible. Peace.